Hey friends, it's Kelly and welcome back to Mama Needs a Gold. Thank you so much for joining me today and if you're new here, welcome. So friends, today I am making chocolate covered pretzel rods again. But today is going to be a little bit different. I wanted to make these for Easter and I wanted to make them resemble carrots. So I am going to try, I've never done this before where I've melted the chocolate. I want to make some little leaves like you have on the top of the carrots and try to attach it to the pretzel rod sticks. I've never done that before. I normally just dip them and throw sprinkles on them and I'm good to go. But this time I'm going to try this um, and see how it works. So if you're watching this video, obviously it turned out well, <laughs> or at least good, good enough to post the video. But anyway, um, and also I think what I'm going to do is dip them in the vanilla um, flavor. Um, I've been calling this friends almond bark the whole time. And my husband pointed out, this is actually not almond bark. It says make your own almond bark with this. I thought this was almond bark. I had no clue. Did not even pick up on that. But anyway, it's really good and I like the flavor of it. And I think it'll look really nice on the tray if I do it in white. And then melt some orange candy melts and drizzle all over the white and then add some orange sprinkles on it. Um, and that way it'll be a little bit brighter and I just think it'll pop a little bit more um, and then have like the little green leaves on the top. So that's what I'm gonna try to do today. So fingers crossed that it actually turns out and um, I, ju I just think it'll look nice um, that way. So let me stop talking or actually let me continue to talk to tell you what I'm gonna do first. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I have some orange, orange, yeah. I have orange. I have green candy melts. I have some in my handy dandy measuring cup. I'm gonna melt those. And then when I melt them, I'm gonna put it in this little um, container that I got at uh, Walmart where the candy melts were. And I'm gonna pour it in here and then I'm gonna draw some leaves with it. And we'll see, hopefully, fingers crossed. So let's go ahead, get this in the microwave. Um, <clears throat> I've mentioned in the past, I have a melt button and I just use that melt button. If you don't have that button, just go ahead and follow the directions on the back of the package. So when this is done, we'll go ahead and start out really well, pour it in here, and then we're gonna try and make our little leaves real quick. All right, my friends, it is melted. Just making sure I get it stirred really, really well so I don't have a lump in there that's gonna stop <clears throat> and clog up the uh, um, spout, nozzle, whatever they're called. And I'm trying to do this so you can see without making a mess. Don't want to take my time either. I'm trying to hurry a little bit at least. <laughs> All right. I should get a napkin. Hey, pal. Well, I'm going to sit my head on the microwave door. Holy smokes, friends. I literally almost banged the side of my face on the microwave door because I forgot to close it. All right. Now I'm struggling. Oh, Lord, help me. Okay. So, I am going to just go ahead and do just like that.
I'm gonna be honest with you, it's starting to set up a little bit. And the arthritis in my hands, I'm a feeling it. Yes, I am. All right, my friends, so here they are. There we go, a little bit better there. And that's what they look like. So I've got all those done, and now I'm going to go ahead and dip the pretzels in the uh, white chocolate. All right, my friends, I know you've seen this a million times, so I am just going to... Do a quick, quick little demonstration for those of you that may be checking in. I just chopped up my chocolate, uh, chopped up my chocolate and melted it. And that's it. All right, <clears throat> I think I'm down to my last one. One thing I noticed, and I don't know if it was user error here, but this was a lot runnier than I've ever, ever had. Um, I'm not sure what the deal was. Um, I may have let it go too long. I didn't have to stir much, so I'm thinking I may have melted it too long. I'm not really sure, but I'm thinking that maybe the answer because I noticed uh, I'll let my husband have that one um, I noticed that it was a lot runnier and when I started it wasn't as lumpy as it usually is when I get it thicker so I think that is why not a big deal I mean I do have some let me see here um, but we're gonna go ahead and let this set up then we're gonna melt some orange and we're just gonna swirl it all over and then we'll attach our little leaves okay my friends it is um, melted all right I'm gonna go ahead and pour this in to I hope you guys can see actually this kind of looks pink instead of orange oh that was not melted or uh, stirred well. Make sure you stir it well because it'll clog the little nozzle up. This is very uh, pink. It's like a coral color, I guess. So it's very Eastery looking though. So I think it's gonna look nice on the tray. The reason, a couple reasons I didn't do it in the this was because one, I thought it was gonna look really dark, and two, prefer the flavor of the other one, but we'll see. Spatula really, really helps guide this in well. Just like that. All right. Put our lid back on and get started. All right, I'm gonna start down this end here and just, I think I'm gonna do back and forth on a couple. Like that, just like that. Yeah, I think I like that. And then I'm gonna add a little dot at the top of each one. And then I'm going to grab my little orange, orange my green, my green um, leaf, 
and just add it right there at the top just like that how cute i'm liking it friends i can't wait till you see this up close oh my goodness i love 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 it And there are my carrot pretzel sticks. How stinking cute. After they set up, I'll give you a close-up. All right, my friends. So here they are, the carrot, chocolate-covered carrot pretzels. Are they too stinking adorable or what? Look at that. Oh, my goodness. I love it. I love it. I love it. Friends, so that'll do it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing as it does greatly help me out. I know you guys have seen me make these chocolate covered pretzels a million times, but I thought this um, was just a really cute idea and I wanted to share that with you um, before I put my tray together, which I will be sharing with you all. I'm sorry it was such a short, quick video. As I mentioned, I have not been feeling overly well, and I really wanted to get something out to you all, and I needed to make these, so I thought, why not? Let's do it. So, um, and also, please go over and check me out on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter and Pinterest as well. I'm very active on Facebook and Instagram, especially. I'm always posting um, tons of content that, um, you know, just everyday life, mom life and things like that, that I'm not always posting on YouTube. So friends, thanks so much for joining me. I do appreciate it and I will catch you next time. Bye.